a money-making machine that can rake in tens or even hundreds of thousands of dollars per year, yet priced at just 20 grand? It can only be the Tesla bot. But how? Elon's mentioned multiple times the task that Tesla's robot could perform, with the number surpassing 1,000 tasks. And with each passing update, it could even hit 5,000 or 10,000 different tasks. The most important part about Optimus is the key technology to do these things. The best robot hand in the world is almost equal to the number of operations that a human hand can do. So, if our hands can do 100 different tasks, it should be able to handle at least 60 of those. So, what exactly can Optimus do in the real world, and how can it make us money? The answers are all here. Welcome to today's episode of Tesla Car World. Now, none of us hate money, and none of us don't crave a less hectic life. Just imagine coming home from work with a pile of house chores still waiting for you. Yeah, it's going to stay that way until you have an optimist living at home with you. The reality is, the idea of owning a robot at home and asking it to handle a bunch of tasks that you either can or don't feel like doing has never really caught our attention, because no one thinks a slow-moving robot is actually going to replace us humans. More accurately, this scenario has only existed in sci-fi movies. However, Optimus is that real-world robot stepping straight out of the movies you've watched, with the exception of T2. <laughs> but seriously, it can fold clothes, water plants, handle slippery objects like eggs or battery cells, and even use a computer. It can also dance, it can squat, it can move around the office with an incredibly natural human-like gait. So you could say pick up a cup, pick up a shirt, fold the shirt. Uh, these, these things will generalize, I think, quite quickly. But that's just the most basic glimpse we've seen of the Optimus. Imagine putting it in a clothing store where it can fold and pack thousands of shirts for customers every day. No more having to pay people to do all that. Farms wouldn't need complex irrigation systems if these robots were involved. Or even crazier, it could grab eggs and make breakfast for the kids every morning. So stepping out of the realm of movies... This is the real-world role of Optimus. It brings mind-blowing convenience, some of which can directly translate into financial benefits for businesses using the Tesla bot. However, to achieve all this, Optimus's hands are considered its most critical feature, and it's where Tesla bot team has focused most of their attention. Just like humans, we'd be almost incapable of doing any task without our hands. A pair of hands with 27 degrees of freedom combined with a brain are two things that make us humans the most intelligent beings on the planet. Now, when manufacturers create a humanoid robot, the brain and hands are the two areas on which they focus most. We expect Tesla to release multiple versions of the robot for customers, and if the starting price for Optimus is 20 grand, as Elon mentioned, the hands alone are likely to be worth 6 to 7K. As we've mentioned before, our hands have 27 degrees of freedom. However, some of you may not fully understand what degrees of freedom in the body actually means. So let's review real quick. Simply put, degrees of freedom describe the number of ways a mechanical system can move. In the context of a humanoid robot's hand, it refers to the independent movements each finger or part of the hand can make. As you can see with Tesla Bot's hand, it can continuously move its fingers like a normal human's, which is something Tesla's competitors have not quite figured out yet. If you want to have a humanoid robot that can um, do things that a human can do, it's actually, it's a, it's a very high bar. So our, our new arm has 22 degrees of freedom instead of 11. This is what Elon shared about the latest hand design for Optimus. To develop the world's most advanced robotic hand, the key component that makes Optimus truly useful for humans, Tesla has had to overcome some major hurdles. In a conversation with Lex Friedman, Musk admitted that the hand for Optimus accounted for about half the engineering work during development. Because, like humans, much of our intelligence is tied to what we can do with our hands, Tesla's upgraded from 11 to 22 degrees of freedom a leap that doubles the previous version, bringing them just five degrees shy of a human hand. Imagine if in the future, Optimus gets 27 degrees of freedom. Now, that might not happen immediately, but if it does, its hands will reach an incredible level of complexity and sophistication, unlocking potentials far beyond what we can imagine. With hands like that, what else could Optimus do? More complex tasks, of course. It could handle intricate surgeries, perform delicate laboratory work, repair advanced machinery, or even create art. The possibility for hand precision tasks in fields like healthcare engineering and manufacturing would expand tremendously, potentially reshaping industries in everyday life. Like in 2026, it's, it's really the kind of thing where you, you could tell it to do kind of a wide range of tasks. 
As mentioned, Elon has discussed a wide range of tasks that Tesla Optimus could take on. However, listing them all from base to complex would likely take up about a thousand different episodes, with each episode showcasing a different job that Tesla's robot can perform, and that would clearly be impossible. Instead, it just makes more sense to focus on the areas that Optimus truly shines and give practical applications that enhance human life and improve work efficiency across different fields, whether it's a homemaker, factory worker, personal assistant, store clerk, security guard, chef, even a teacher. The list goes on. Clearly, Optimus is not inferior to a human, and sometimes we got to acknowledge that AI-integrated tasks into its software might even be smarter than us in certain areas. You need AI, real, you need to be the best in real-world AI, and Tesla's the best in real-world AI. Optimus is equipped with Tesla's artificial neural network and advanced computer vision systems. Thanks to Tesla's neural network, Optimus can learn and handle complex tasks just by observing for the first time, and it can relearn really quickly, as Musk said. It can watch a video of something like a person and, and then learn just by looking at that video and, and do that task. We're sure a lot of people are wondering how these robots will learn new tasks and just how long it takes to train them before they can actually get the job done. Obviously, they just need to watch a video, and you don't have to do anything. Imagine if you had a robot like Optimus at home teaching you how to play the piano, something you feel like you can't teach yourself. Just show it a video of someone playing your favorite song, and then the robot analyzes the hand movements, the chords, even the rhythm. Then it would guide you step by step, just like you're learning from a human teacher. Our next generation has 22 degrees of freedom. Um, it will be able to play the piano. So it's, it's really like, wow. That would be amazing. You wouldn't just get instructions. You'd actually get the robot to demonstrate it for you, correcting you if you got the wrong chord or lost your rhythm. It could even create a fun practice session, encouraging you to improve every day. And what if you like cooking? You could pull up a video showing how to make your favorite food. The robot would watch and learn from that video, then help you from start to finish. It will remind you to gather the ingredients, guide you step by step, and even adjust the recipe to suit your taste. Instead of fumbling through a cookbook or watching a long tutorial, you'd have a personal chef right in your house to assist you. Yeah, and those are the more complex tasks that Optimus can actually do with its hands. While the artificial network allows Optimus to self-learn new tasks, its computer vision system ensures that the robot accurately perceives its surroundings and objects. In the promo videos Tesla's shown us before, the vision system simply allowed it to recognize objects and color, sorting them out accordingly. The reality is, this vision enables Optimus to accomplish tasks you wouldn't even expect. Thanks to this system, the robot can analyze and accurately identify everything around it. For example, when moving around the house, Optimus can recognize objects like tables, chairs, even a cat lying on the floor. In more complex industrial environments, especially in a massive factory like Giga Texas, Optimus will also optimize terrain recognition capabilities. It can transport goods while ensuring the safety of those around it, recognizing obstacles like people, machines, and cargo, and deciding on the safest route to take. One of the standout abilities of Optimus, thanks to its advanced computer vision, is its ability to detect hazards. For example, it can spot sharp objects you might actually leave out while kids are playing nearby, or even worse, someone trying to break into your house with the intent to steal or attack you. Sounds scary, but when people often ask what humanoid robots can do, this is one of the best examples to illustrate their potential. Equipped with around eight 2D cameras and sensitive sensors, it can identify the shape and size of weapons or the actions of strangers. If it detects anything suspicious, it'll alert you or call the police, so you really cannot underestimate Tesla Optimus's vision. When you look at the images of Optimus using and interacting with computers, it's clear that it can also serve as your personal assistant. In the recent photos Tesla shared, it can type on a keyboard, use a mouse, hold a smartphone, and even handle an envelope while talking on the phone at the same time. More incredibly is the image of it holding a pen to write on a piece of paper along with many other activities. These images are pretty darn impressive because they show how Optimus's hands and perform just like a human's would. With these capabilities, Optimus could become a valuable office assistant, helping you manage daily tasks. For example, it could quickly and accurately respond to emails, contact partners to send necessary documents, and remind you about your work schedule. Optimus could even organize meetings by suggesting suitable times for everyone and noting down important points during discussions. 
With its impressive actions and flexible movements in an office environment, the idea of an optimist as an assistant does not seem that far-fetched. In fact, it's possible that one day it'll be standing next to you, helping you work much more efficiently and making more money. There are many other tasks optimists could take on, like educating kids or participating in EV production at Tesla, which Elon has already talked about. However, it's hard to go into detail since we still need to wait for its launch and final performance specs. There are about five more updates that Elon announced for the Optimus Gen 3 version. In addition to its hands, Optimus will feature a new design using lighter materials to reduce the robot's weight. This design will include new features like LED lights and a display on its face to show work progress and status. Another upgrade will be movement speed. Right now, Optimus goes at a speed of about 0.6 meters a second, which is kind of slow, but Tesla plans to boost that from 2 to 3 meters a second. This upgrade will require movements in hardware components like motors and joints to enhance efficiency and stability. Elon confirmed that these hardware modifications are crucial for improving the robot's agility, allowing it to navigate different environments from factories to houses. Next up is the addition of voice and language, which is a crucial feature that will enhance user interaction. The upcoming Gen 3 version will be able to communicate in multiple languages and understand user preferences, making it more adaptable globally. Users will have the option to customize Optimus's voice and personality, allowing the robot to function like a personal assistant that can communicate naturally. And finally, Tesla will focus on improving Optimus's learning and adaptability. With the implementation of Video In Controls Out Neural Network, the robot will be able to observe tasks and automatically replicate them. This development not only positions Optimus as a household assistant, but could also turn it into a healthcare companion, monitoring health conditions and giving timely alerts. By integrating with Tesla's existing FSD technology, Optimus will benefit from ongoing improvements in AI performance and decision-making capabilities. These five upgrades will allow Tesla to reach new heights in developing an almost perfect version that can very closely mimic us humans, expanding its potential applications across various fields. After all, while Optimus is considered the world leader in humanoid robot technology and creates a massive demand to change how people work, wherever there's technology, there's going to be competition. And when it comes to tech, China's right there with it. So if you pay attention, you'll probably notice that since Tesla created a buzz with Optimus by launching Gen 2 versions late last year, a host of other robot companies out of China have suddenly come up out of nowhere. And when China focuses on something, it tends to become a trend because they'll likely flood the market with it. So robots are definitely what they're targeting. Goldman Sachs predicted back in Jan that the global market for robots will reach 38 billion by 2035, with nearly 1.4 million shipments for consumer and industrial applications. They estimate that the material costs to make them have dropped to around 150 grand each by last year, not including research and development expenses. To achieve a price of 20 grand for Optimus, Elon has had to break down numerous factors to make it accessible for customers. If you look for a few humanoid robots currently out there, Prices go from seventy to one hundred and twenty thousand dollars, so they're definitely not cheap. To hit that twenty grand price point for Optimus, Elon admitted that Tesla has managed to bring production costs down to just ten thousand dollars. The reason is that they have access to batteries, motors, sensors, and many hardware components that can be shared with Tesla's electronic vehicles. Moreover, they've got big factories for producing Optimus, and FSD software is already there, meaning they don't have to rely heavily on outside suppliers to make these robots. That's a big advantage for Tesla. Although Optimus is generating lots of buzz and demand, it still faces intense competition. With rapid advancements in China and other parts of the world, Tesla will need to adjust its production to keep up with the increasing demand and technological progress. Optimus could be the key to the next major revolution in automation. From impressive developments in robotics like Boston Dynamics' Atlas to Tesla's Optimus robot, we're seeing major advancements in robotics and AI. However, while these advancements promise to open up new opportunities, manufacturing and deploying them in real-world environments still present some challenges. Optimizing the physical processing capabilities of robots, along with their interaction with surrounding environments, is essential to realizing the vision of a world where robots can take on a wide range of diverse and complex tasks. While current robots mainly operate in controlled environments like factories and warehouses, their future will depend on the researcher's ability to develop not just software, but also hardware. As analysts have pointed out, to achieve general artificial intelligence, Humanoid robots need a physical form to effectively understand and interact with the outside real world. The development of these humanoid robots and new designs, although promising, also needs to be approached a lot more practically. 
Researchers emphasize that robot designs don't necessarily have to resemble humans. They should just be optimized for specific tasks. This indicates to us that as technology continues to evolve, finding the optimal design for each type of robot will be key to realizing their potential in our everyday lives. So, we want to ask you, the viewer watching this video, what features do you think are more important for Tesla robots to meet your needs? And what are you most looking forward to in the next version of Optimus? Thank you so much for watching our video. If you found the content helpful and want to explore more exciting info about Tesla's electronic vehicles, don't forget to hit the like button and be sure you share this video with your friends. Also, make sure you're subscribed to Tesla Car World and turn on those notifications so you'll never miss out on our videos. We update them every day, sometimes twice a day for you. And with that, we certainly appreciate your support and humbly hope we see you back here for our next video update. Thank you so much for watching. Take care, stay safe, and God bless you. Goodbye.